I'm Sai to Go's volunteer. My name is Michael. I'm 17 and I enjoy long romantic walks down the beach. Today's article is about people who tend to sleep late have a higher IQ by Risha May. Risha got into a study when the psychologist Satoshi Kanazawa made a survey for people in their late 20s. As the survey showed right here, Kanazawa showed that those with an IQ of over 125 tended to go to bed around 12.30 a.m. and wake up around 8 a.m. on the weekdays and go to bed around 1.45 a.m. and wake up around 11 a.m. on the weekends. Those of normal intelligence tended to go to sleep from 12 a.m. to 7.30 a.m. on the weekdays and from 1.15 a.m. to 10.15 a.m. on the weekends. Those of below normal intelligence tended to go to sleep from 11.45 a.m. to 7.20 a.m. on the weekdays and from 12.35 a.m. to 10 a.m. on the weekends. As you can see, that's a pretty big difference. Now, that doesn't mean because you go to sleep later, you're more intelligent than those who don't. There's plenty of factors to consider, like some studies show that the more intelligent people, women in particular, tend to have children later on and have fewer children, which allows them to sleep in later on more than their friends or family members. Another important factor is the type of jobs people tend to hold, which is also a big contribution when it comes to a person's intelligence. A point in the study that smarter people can adapt more quickly to changing conditions and can sometimes adapt habits that don't really make sense, while people of lower IQ tend to restrict their activities to mostly the daytime. But everything does have its up and downside. Having less sleep is not really that healthy for the body. Night owls can be more prone to sickness like depression or heart failures. They can also be less reliable, more emotionally unstable, and are more likely to have an addiction or an eating disorder. Some addictions can be like alcohol or smoking. While on the upside for early risers, they can be more conscientious, persistent, and can cooperate better. They can also cope better with academic requirements and receive better grades, which would sort of explain why staying up until 2 a.m. playing Pokemon will not give you good grades. Hypothetically speaking, of course, not from experience, I swear. Some questions for you guys. Is it better to be a night owl or early riser? Do you tend to sleep late or wake up early and how does it affect you in the morning? And do you go to sleep late sometimes because is it hard to fall asleep for you? Don't forget to subscribe to the YouTube channel if you enjoyed. And also, make sure to follow them on Twitter, Facebook, and Tumblr. Well, until next time, see you guys.